man in the middle attack in short we call it as mitm attack man in the middle attack happens when a hacker inserts manipulates the traffic by being in between the client and the server the common types of these attacks are session hijacking ip spoofing and replay we'll see each one of them session hijacking session hijacking happens when a hacker hijacks the established connection between the client and the server the attacker changes the ip address of a trusted client making the computer believe that it is communicating with the actual server ip spoofing ip spoofing is used to convince the victim that he or she is connected to a trusted and known entity this ultimately results in the attacker gaining access to the system the attacker starts communicating with the victim as if he knows the address and makes the victim accept the packet and infect the user's system next is a replay a replay attack which is also known as a playback attack happens when a data transmission is hacked and purposely delayed or repeated this gives the user the sense that the transaction is complete but the hacker can still access the server through the transaction initiated by the attacker unless mitigating steps are taken these kinds of attacks are repeated and the user or the victim generally assume that all the transactions are done in a legitimate manner using digital signatures with time stamps can help to stop these kinds of man in the middle attack depending on the nature of the application providing the option of one time password can help to stop unwanted eaves dropping when a client and the server are communicating during a session